So this is a quick video about the Olfa SVR1. This is the company's stainless steel utility knife. It's a very popular utility knife. It sells for about maybe eight or nine dollars. Very easy to find on Amazon, Home Depot, places like that. And if you're looking for a EDC style or very easy to use, slim, pocketable utility knife, this is a popular one that people go with. It's uh, again, model is SVR1 and uses the three eighths or nine millimeter blade type. So it's a skinnier blade. So you want to be careful with it. Uh, the instructions on it are actually really limited. So I want to do a quick video about how you change the blade and then how you snap off the blade when the end of this has dulled. First of all, just speaking of how small the blade is, the uh, nine millimeter size, it's not very wide. So you definitely don't want to use it extended like this. This thing's not a, not a sword. It is meant to be used with a single blade exposed just like that. This is how you use this utility knife, almost as if it was a box cutter. First of all, let's note that the clip is removable. You remove the clip and that's a, actually a very important function and it's not immediately obvious that the clip can be pulled off. So make sure you know that this could be removed because when you want to change the blade, say you have a new blade and you wanna just change it out, you're gonna remove the clip, put that aside, and now, you pull the entire blade apparatus out. I've seen, uh, it seems more obvious that you would try to push it out this way and really force it out, but that's not possible. That's just not how you change the blade on this one. You pull it and now you have two separate components. You have your blade component and the plastic clip. You unclip this piece put the new one in, you wanna be really careful because this thing just wants to swing around. And now you slide this in, again, really careful. This angled side always goes up, slide it in, now you're good. Once you hear that click, it's locked into place and you wanna immediately put your clip back in place and now it is secure or as secure as utility knife is gonna be. Okay, the next step is how do you snap off the blade? When the end is no longer sharp, you'll want to snap it off. Extend it to a single piece like this. You can see the marking there. And what Olfa says to do is to get the clip, remove the clip, and to snap it off like this. See that little notch right there? That is to snap it off. Just apply some lateral pressure to the blade and you snap it off. That's, that's a fine way to go. Your hand is pretty close to the blade. You're using this fickle little clip thing. I don't love it. If it's in a pinch, sure, that'll work. Uh, better off, get a pair of pliers, put some gloves on, and it doesn't really matter what pliers you have, honestly, anything that could apply some lateral pressure. And there you go. Did a quick snap. New blade is there. The old one is right there. You wanna be really careful with that. Dispose of it safely, hopefully in a sharps container or something like that. Put this back, put the clip back in place, and now it's uh, fully snapped off and you're ready to go.